Hello, this is Rich Campy, your thinking coach. Today's grin message, I am grateful for new starts. And the intentional message is focus. It's so important, I thought we should cover it one more time because focus is power. Let's get to that right now. All right, so let's do a focus is power experiment. So I want you to take a look at everything in this book, Be the First Believer, everything that's white. Everything that's white. Just look at everything that you see that's white on here. All right, you got it? Everything that's white. Good. All right, now, tell me everything in the book that you saw that was green. Everything that was green. What about red? Everything that was red. Everything was black. So typically what happens in this is we focus on what we get, right? So if you focused on everything was white, what you remember is everything was white. You didn't look for the green. You didn't look that there was the green down here over the mountains, right? Or the black, you know, shadow or the black mountain of the person, right? Or even the red dot you might not have seen. So again, focus is power and we get what we focus on. So a lot of times we miss things just because we're not focused on it. So let's talk about focus is power. Let's use the story or the example of the new race car driver. The new race car driver gets in the driver's seat. A coach or instructor sits in the passenger seat. There's a little button that exists on the floorboard that if they push that button, it causes one tire to lift just enough off the ground that it causes the car to spin out of control. Where do you think that new driver focuses when the car spins out of control? The wall or the open track? That's right. They actually focus on the wall. As the car spins, where does that car go as the new driver focuses on the wall? That's right, it goes right towards the wall. The instructor will literally force that driver's head to look at the open road. And as that driver looks at the open road, the car regains composure and starts spinning around the track again. The same thing is true in life. We have to manage our focus. We have to focus on what we want because focus is power. If we focus on what we don't want, that's exactly what we start to get, the wall. So focusing on the open road or the track is exactly where the car starts to move when we focus on it. So where are you focused? And how will you be the first believer to focus on what you want? Creating focus is power.